Hello lads, we're back with another Ancient Warfare 3, except we're doing battles that I actually built. So this will be a shorter video, probably actually a really short video if I'm going to be honest. But let's just hop right into it, nevertheless. Uh, the first battle is called the Beach Siege or something. To explain it before we hop in, we have the the Americanos pulling up and boats and stuff, you know, on their beautiful boats over here the uh, Germans uh, well they're zombies and the Germans are surrounded by zombies right now that's not too good for them also over here they have three Jeeps and they got a Panzer got a couple dudes in their tents basically their beach is getting raided the French the French have already made a push onto the beach they even got a tank onto the beach and uh, yeah let's see how this goes because I actually don't know how it's gonna go I'm gonna be honest the boat are starting to travel. Looks like the first gunshot has already rained off. A whole cannon shot from one guy. Looks like the Germans are getting shots off. See if they can kill one. One French. So yeah, the Germans are heavily, heavily, heavily outnumbered by the French. The only problem is which does seem to be presenting an issue because you know boats uh the infected they're just chilling. some of the boats are actually about to land maybe make some progress who knows who knows ooh, ooh, ooh. landed there we go looks like the troops the troops you know, there, there we go, now they're unloading. Now the troops are beginning to unload from the boats. Looks like the Germans might have taken a little bit too much time. Though it does seem the Germans do have a panzer on their side, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all. The only problem is it's running over its own people, but still with the panzer. We'll see how the, uh, how the Germans do. The French are packing, uh, packing, not, not packing, they are, uh, let's pause time for a second, the, no, let's just do times 10, okay. the French are actually using MP40s that they stole from the Germans, so that's, that's that situation, so the Germans are only using rifles, it does, I believe, there is a plane over here that one of them could fly, but they didn't want it to fly, Actually, I'm gonna see if I can get one of these guys on the plane. Cause it is a landed plane. Oh, well that's stupid. Pretty sure you can fly this though. Oh, it does look like the French did win this battle. Um, let's just hop right over straight to the next one. Cause I did say this would be a little quicker than all their other videos. So we'll just. That was a, that was a short battle that I built. This one. It's, I just legit named it Attack on the Modern Base, so basically I'll explain it, because it's a little, little confusing. Uh, so basically what's happening here is the terrorists are pushing on a military base. They got a tank out front, but the terrorists are packing a lot of good weapons. Though there are four choppers loaded with troops. Um, they are loaded with troops, it just doesn't show that. But they are, because it does say 20 out of 20. Uh, there are zombies here. Don't ask how. Uh, just some civilians that got a little infected from the gas. And we got some police up here on the front to uh, deal with that. There are two turrets on top of the uh, military base. I hope you all like the base. I think it's a nice base. I think it's... This is what took me a long time to make. What is this base? Got a gun in here. Uh, I could definitely use this area, but I didn't for this battle. But there's like ammo, weapons. There's like this little sniper tower. Can we see the people inside the chopper? I don't think we can see them until they land. But yeah, over here, we just got a police force with batons. I did put a couple guys in here. These are futuristic people. So, you know, they got them laser guns. Anyways, let's see how this goes. We're going to start off slow just because it 
is pretty fast. They have an LMG up here on the front lines. So they also got one up here. That's probably going to do a lot of damage to these troops down here. I'm going to be honest with you. These choppers are flying. It's going to be a little laggy, which is expected. Um, I'm going to try to fl get away from the choppers. Cause that's what it's Oh my lag. Okay, I'm trying to decide if it's better to go slow or fast. Alright, it's better to go slow. Alright, let's see how these guys are doing. A lot of the ground troops are dying, but the the tanks are definitely doing some damage. Looks like looks like they're starting to take destroy the wall. Starting to destroy the wall, actually. Which is gonna be a problem. The the game the game the red are heavily outnumbered, but you do have to consider they do have tanks. A lot of tanks. A lot of tanks. So that should go into consideration. It looks like, ooh. There you go. Now you can see the people in the choppers. Yeah, these are loaded out troops ready to, ready to go in. There is a knife dude in here. Let's try to speed up time a little bit. Looks like a lot of the infected... Looks like the infected are doing some work on our guys over here. Um, looks like one of our own guys actually got shot by one of the scientists over here. Does seem the front line of defense has fallen, the turrets, the troops are all dead. Does look like there is a lot of red people left, and also all the tanks are still standing, so that's gonna be an issue. The choppers are starting to unload their troops though, let's speed up time a little bit. Get a nice look at this, I find this cool. I could. You can like play as your player, you can play as a player and sit in the chopper, and then you can like go down the rope and you can shoot on the rope. I wasn't doing that though, because um, well, then we would miss the whole front battle here because I can see we wouldn't be able to see what took place. It does seem these troops are going to be pushing through the inside, while the tanks are pushing on the outside. It does seem there's one elite in here gonna fight elite soldiers these guys are top-notch military they got flashbangs they got assault rifles got some scientists over here scientists dexed out with some new experiment weapons some laser weapons. Uh, how do I... oh well it does seem that the military has unloaded all of their troops all the reinforcements are pushing in Let's see how this works out. Looks like some uh, some of the terrorists, rebels, whatever you want to call them. Uh, the, the civilians see them as rebels, the military sees them as terrorists. We'll call them the rebellion here because they are rebelling against the government. It does seem this attack force is getting wiped out by the military. But at the same time, the military troops are more and basically a lot more superior than standard but it does seem the rebels the last three were able to take out this large force though there is a large group left over here we're gonna see how they can do looks like there's two tanks they'll have to take out if they want a successful bullet don't ask about this this was uh, a work in progress uh, <laughs> don't don't ask about it uh does seem actually I might as well possess one of these guys and try to Try to get the military the dub. Ooh, that was my bad. I shouldn't have done that. I could have played a lot smarter there. Uh, is there any stairs? Crap, there's a ladder. I'm gonna try to get up stairs, honestly. Can I go up this? I forgot. I don't think this is climbable. It is, it is. Okay. Um. I'm gonna try to get in the room with the LMG in it and maybe pull off the dub right here. Alright, let's go. I believe there's an LMG in here. LMG. And we have the uh, RPG. So. Oh, man. <laughs> Yo. Wow, that, that was a cool ending right there, how it like blew up the room. Anyways, that 
is the end of our short as i said this was gonna be a short video 10 minutes pretty quick pretty basic i hope all of you enjoyed this is your boy uh your boy jaden vr going dark and i mean honestly before before we go dark we might as well uh we might as well uh nuke yeah we might as well nuke this why not right doesn't hurt uh yeah we have to be red team to nuke this um air be all cool plane will drop units nope we want the bomber plane a heavy armored helicopter with bombs and machine guns yep that's what we want we actually want to bomb right over this we'll get we'll get multiple bomber planes and hope one of these guys can successfully uh nuclear bombs yeah we're gonna drop nuclear bombs Drop carpet. Prefer target ground. Uh, same here. Nuclear bombs. If one of you fail, there's 20 of you. I'm hoping you guys can pull this off. There's 20 of you. All I need you to do is successfully bomb. All right. And just to make sure this success.